happen. And you guys are gonna help, correct? 106? All right. So now it's time for... The Let's Bowl go. of Randomness! <laughs> <laughs> This is, it's, um, is this dangerous? Yeah, okay, so this is what we're gonna do here, okay? We have this uh, magic bowl, and you're gonna reach in here, some it's questions. It's just not any bowl, oh, oh, it's, it's Garrett's. Popcorn. Chicago, <laughs> that's Chicago's right. Finest. That's... All right, yes. first question. What's one thing you miss about your life book for becoming first lady? That's a great question. Mm. Yes. You know, you would imagine how, an anonymity, you know? Being able to walk out your front door on your own, without agents, <laughs> people following you around. I've just longed to walk out that front door, go to CVS <laughs> and buy some toothpaste. Yeah. I'm with you. <laughs> and nobody would notice me. Have you so, ever tried? Like maybe like I've a had, wig and beards and all that? I do a cap and you know, I've taken the dogs out for a walk. I've gotten a sneak into Target a couple of times, <laughs> but the longer we're here, the more people it's harder, because I was doing that when we first got here. So anonymity is something that I miss. <laughs> I couldn't imagine just like walking into Target and you just, that, that, that would just be, be like... Be like, is that who I think it is? Yeah. Well, the yeah. first time I did that, I was in an aisle. One woman walked up to me and she tapped me on the shoulder and I thought, okay, she's, she's peed me. And she said, can you reach up there and hand oh, me that detergent? No. <laughs> and I was like, all right. So, all right, here we go. Okay. <laughs> Question number two. Question number two. On a scale of one to 10, how awesome was it when the president started singing, let's stay together, Al Green? <laughs> that was pretty awesome. I mean, he's got a pretty good voice. He does. I always say, my husband's got swag, you know? Uh -oh. Yes, Michelle. He's got, he's got a little he, swag. He definitely yeah. does. Yeah, yeah, no, it was really sweet. <laughs> but he sings all the time. Oh. Oh, yeah, he's in the bathroom all the time, just <laughs> singing. He's always willing to sing. He's like, you want me to sing that? Want to, want to sing something for you? But he's got a good voice. That was very sweet. All right, well, here we go. Another one. Another one. Let's reach number in. Number three. There we go. What's your biggest fashion regret? Ooh, that's a tough one. Yeah. Wow, biggest fashion regret. I don't have an answer to this one. I, I kind of always am happy with what I'm wearing. <laughs> I, 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 we agree. I, I think, you know. Sometimes as first lady, sometimes I forget I'm the first lady and I'm like running around in shorts. I know the first time we went on a family vacation, I had shorts on getting off of Air Force One and that created a huge stink because people were like, she's wearing shorts what? getting off of Air Force One. And I thought we're, we're on vacation. Yeah, <laughs> and you have to be comfortable when you fly. It yeah. was hot. <laughs> so I've avoided shorts getting off of Air Force One. Let's All get right. one more. All right, one, one more, more one more, one more, one more. Who's a better dancer, you Ooh. or the president? That's easy. Uh-oh. Me. Uh, hey, now. <laughs> hey, Without a doubt. Hey. Without a doubt. Hey. Without a doubt. <laughs> he can sing, I can dance. I think that divides the talent evenly across the family tree. We're all satisfied. <laughs> yes. So thank you for answering the questions in the bowl of randomness. Thank you, guys. That's yeah, fun. Me and Belle actually have a random question for you. You have one? Uh, you got one? Oh, I'll go first. Okay, go ahead. Okay. So what is a pickup line that President Obama has used on you? Oh, my goodness. Ooh. <laughs> you know, it wasn't a line. It was a whole day. Our first date. <laughs> He laid it out. I mean, he, he, he covered every base. He took me to an art museum, and then he was yeah. talking Picasso, and so he showed me his little cultural side, and then we went for a long walk, and we went to see the opening of Do the Right Thing, Spike Lee, okay. so he showed me oh. his, his swag side, and we had a deep <laughs> conversation about that, and we ended it on having drinks on the top of the John Hancock building in Chicago. That was our first date. Wow! Yeah. I need to, that I was need a to whole step day. my game up. <laughs> yes! I have to totally step my game up. And, and my question for you is, what is the first lady's guilty pleasure? Oh, I could go on and on. Garrett's popcorn, <laughs> pizza, french fries. I mean, I believe in let's move, but, but I always talk about life and balance. I work hard, hard. Yeah. I work out hard, I work out every day. So if I want some french fries, I would say french fries are my most favorite guilty pleasure. If I could eat french fries 24-7, I would. But 
folks, we can't do that. So <laughs> that's my message. You know, eat your vegetables, get your workout in, let's move, all that good stuff. But a French fry every now and then, not, not too bad. You are so fun. Do you have do you have any last words for our one? You said a lot of amazing things, but any last words you want to give? Well, what I want young people out there to know is that to